Hi, this is Albert with Mainland Cycle Center. Today I want to show you the 2014 KTM 1290 Super Duke. Uh, this is the first orange one of these we've got in. We did a video on the black one last week. And uh, we got an orange one in today. This is just an awesome, awesome bike. Absolutely incredible. 1290 cc's, 180 horsepower. A steel trellis frame that is super light. It's also called a space frame. Uh, I love this color. The orange one is kind of my favorite, but uh, the black is just stunning. Uh, very aggressive looking also. Single sided swing arm, uh, Brembo brakes, front and rear. Has the smoked out tail light with red uh, LEDs in it. Let's take a look at that because the tail light looks really cool on this bike. There. Look at your rear wheel brake. The 1290 script right under there really looks cool. Got uh, adjustable peg on the shift lever. Of course, you can adjust the lever up and down also. Your Brembo four piston radially mounted calipers. Of course, this bike has ABS, traction control, and it has power modes. Uh, adjustable levers, you can turn here to adjust your levers. There. The LED uh, DRLs, uh, daytime running light. <coughs> Excuse me. Inverted front forks from WP. The wheels are really cool looking. Again, we've got the Brembo brake calipers on the front. Uh, little, uh, I call this an oil cooler. It's actually called a heat exchanger. You can see it has dual fans on this side of the radiator. Uh, this is the hot side of the radiator, so you have hot water coming in, and then the cool water is exiting the other side. And you've got uh, this really great instrumentation. Uh, so you've got a fuel gauge, which is actually a first for KTM. Most of their bikes have not had fuel gauges in the past. Uh, we also have it on the uh, new Adventure, the 1190 Adventure. Uh, temperature gauge, clock, odometer, gear position indicator. And then over here gives you uh, all of that other information. Hopefully you can see that. But, uh, maybe that will be a little better. But uh, you've got a favorites, drive mode. And you, just, you can change that real easy. Put it on sport, which gives you that full 180 horsepower. Street, which will tone it down a little bit. And then you've got rain mode. So those are all power to uh, change the power modes. Motorcycle traction control, ABS, and then ABS mode. You can turn the ABS off completely, or you can put this in the ABS uh, supermoto mode. And uh, that will turn off just the rear ABS. So now it says ABS mode supermoto. So now there's no anti lock on the back, but you still have ABS on the front. Now, once you turn the bike off, we'll turn the key off and turn the bike back on, it's going to turn all the ABS systems back on. Okay? Uh, so uh, there we are. So we're back to road, so forth. So if you turn it off and then you turn the key off, you're going to, if you want the ABS off, you'll have to turn it back off again. It's going to default to having the ABS on for safety reasons. Uh, really nice, easy to use uh, buttons here. So the set will let you choose what you want to set. This will let you scroll, and then this one will let you exit. So very, very simple, very easy to navigate the menu with just a little bit of practice. Uh, this is switch, uh, fuel fill cap. Uh, here's your front oil tank, uh, oil fill, oil filter. Got a drain plug here and a drain plug here. This one has a screen behind it. Got a little decal, a little... Uh, here on the swing arm that keeps your heel from rubbing uh, the paint off the swing arm. Uh, pop your seat off right there. Uh, it does have a little cable to uh, lock your helmet on. Let's go ahead and crank her up for you. This is really a nice looking muffler for a, uh, for a stock muffler. It really has a good look to it. Not loud, but...
and we don't want to rev the fool out of it. It's a brand new bike. Now, I always get a lot of asks about uh, height. Now, this bike is fairly tall. I'm about 5'6", and what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to set the camera down, and I'll go over and sit on it, and you can at least get a feel for how it looks uh, with someone my height. Anyway, hopefully you got this. You can see that, but uh, you know it's a little tall. I'm five six with a thirty inch inseam, and uh, it's a little tall for me. We'll see if they have a kit to lower it or anything like that. This is a linkageless rear suspension, so there's not a uh, there's no no linkage on that suspension. It's just the shock to bolted to the frame and to the swing arm. But uh, all right, that's a look at the 2014 KTM 1290 Super Duke in the orange. All right, we are Mainland Cycle Center. We're located in Lamarck, Texas. We're about 30 minutes south of downtown Houston, just off of I-45. You can find us online at mainlandcyclecenter.com, by phone at 409-948-4969. And we would just love it if you'd give us a call, shoot us an email, or even better, come by and see us in person here at Mainland Cycle Center, where we'd love to help just any way that we can. Hey, thanks for watching.